What's good, y'all? Rugs here. Today's soap review features First Line Shave, a Christmas shave. First Line Shave is an artisan based out of St. Louis, Missouri. Uh, he's teamed up with Chicano Designs from Instagram to uh, create this Christmas themed soap. Uh, you'll recognize the uh, label design as a, an iconic movie from uh, Christmas time past. Uh, this is set to release on December 6th, which happens to be St. Nicholas Day. Um, it'll be available from firstliveshave.com, maggotrazors.com, and murphyandmcneil.com, and will come in soap, splash, and EDP. So, a Christmas shave is an homage to Terre de Hermes which is a widely popular men's fragrance. This was uh, designed with the intent to evoke some of the holiday smells you, you're used to, uh, but make something that's basically usable year round and not, not so specific to uh, the holiday theme, if you will. This features notes of orange, grapefruit, pepper, pelargonium, benzoin, vetiver, cedar, and patchouli. Having smelt the uh, fragrance that this pays homage to, I can tell you that this is not an exact match, uh, but it is very close. Uh, so if you do enjoy Terry de Hermes, I believe you will enjoy this quite a bit yourself. Mrs. Rudds absolutely loves this scent for any occasion, including uh, date nights. She finds it masculine, sexy, and very wearable for me. Scent strength on this is strong out of the container and remains strong once lathered and shaved with. And trythatsoap.com recommends Fine La Orange Noir as a similar scent profile. So now that uh, No Shave November is over, we're going to uh, take this beard off. The uh, Christmas Shave is offered in the First Line Shave 2.0 formula which was an improvement over the previous soap base, if you'll recall from my review of Razor Ruby. It is an animal-based soap. I will list the ingredients below for you to take a peek at. The soap is of mid-firmness on the first firmness spectrum and is what I would consider a thirsty soap, but not overly thirsty. When you do properly dial in this soap, you will arrive at a lather that has the consistency of sour cream. Excellent slickness on this soap, both in terms of primary and residual slickness. And post-shave on this is absolutely elite. You can easily forego a post-shave product when using this soap base, and you will feel no detriments to your skin. If you choose to do that. The more I use this First Line Shave 2.0 soap base, the more impressed I become with it. I think familiarity goes a long way to uh, boosting a shave score, if you will. Given my experience, with FLS 2.0, I 
and the metrics we just mentioned above, FLS 2.0 receives a shape score of 95. For similar performing soap bases, I'd suggest you check out Declaration Grooming Bison or Holy Cow Donkey Milk. So as you can see, a uh, successful beard off with the A Christmas Shave by First Line Shave and Chicano Designs. Do hope you'll have an opportunity to check this one out on December 6th when it releases. Uh, really cool scent and uh, I think it's going to be right up a lot of people's alleys. As always, thumbs up the video if you enjoyed it. Comment below if you have anything to say and if you're not a subscriber, please become one. See ya.